Uh. <laughs> hey everybody welcome welcome this afternoon this wednesday afternoon from quitman texas it is cold here it's got to be what 32 30s. degrees outside oh. which is what zero zero <laughs> celsius in canada wherever you live that's got Canada but we're happy to be here with you we've got a fun program planned for you and we're gonna talk about quilting and we're gonna share some information and just really have a good time with you uh, we've got your comments up if you have a question during the show be sure and ask it and we'll try to 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 answer your questions and and uh, get everything going with you I'm Deb Luttrell and I'm here with my friend Christy. Christy Smith Christy is Smith. our now new creative director. We brought her in all the way from Alabama. <laughs> She's got the cutest little accent, y'all. You think my Texas accent is cute? You just wait till you hear her. Oh, She's thank adorable. You. <laughs> she is adorable. Well, today we want to start off our program with a couple of wonderful ladies. Uh, and we're going to talk about this beautiful, gorgeous quilt hanging behind us called Fandango. I'd like to introduce you to Norma Real and Nancy Hakey. Is that right, Nancy? Hakey, uh-huh. You're right. Hackey. We're going to hack. Hackey. <laughs> well, these two ladies work together to make this quilt that's behind us. We uh, are going to be hosting this quilt as a Zoom class in April, I believe it's April 23rd with Norma. Norma yeah. pinched the quilt and um, we just wanted to talk about you guys and talk about the quilt and your part in it and um, how it came to be and all of that kind of good stuff. But first of all, Norma, tell us where you live and tell us a little bit about yourself. Sure. Um, I started quilting in 2001, and I am a country Texas girl by heart, but I lived in Kansas for a long time and moved to Texas about 2011, and before that lived in Michigan about 12 years, but I started Norma's Quilt Studio in 2001, and I love to teach and love to inspire others, so um, I, before the pandemic, I was teaching about 40 classes per year. And then the pandemic just threw me into a whole new world. So I started uh, teaching online, uh, taught for the virtual quilt show in April 2020 and November 2020. And now I'm kind of the online um, teacher guru because I teach a lot of online classes and I'm really looking forward to teaching Fandango for Stitch in Heaven in April. Awesome. Awesome. How about you, Nancy? Nancy is the quilting guru of this quilt yes i i what got me started i loved art and took art and oil painting all through high school um got married at 18 found myself making everything my kids wore um when my oldest was about 11 they came out with the first home computers i was so fascinated with them that i taught myself how to draw now this will really date me i taught myself how to draw in dos I was wow. doing Disney. Yeah, I was doing Disney characters. So I remember Dawes. Yeah, it was it was not easy. It wasn't um, pretty. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Fast forward to 2011, I bought my first quilting machine in 2011. One of my customers that I was quilting for wanted a whimsical heart design. And everywhere I searched, I could not find something she was happy with and Finally, one of the guys at Gamble that knew me said, just do it yourself. And I says, no, I can draw it, but I can't get it from the drawing to the computer. And he says, I'll help you. Just draw it and get there. So he helped me over the internet, digitize the art pattern I had drawn. And when I put it on the computer and it, it quilted out, I was fascinated. I thought, look, I did it, it worked. Yeah. And, and, you know, with the encouragement of family, friends, um, we ended up opening up our first uh, website our, in 2011. Um, family just kept encouraging me. Some friends in the quilting industry kept encouraging me. And we started, uh, customers kept calling and saying, okay, now you've got your site open. We want a club. And I thought, oh, I can't do that. I have 
15 grandkids. They all live close by. I'm so busy trying to make a living. I don't have time. And they just kept pushing and pushing until we came out with the 25 for 25. And then it grew to 35 and, and now more. But it's just taken off. And here I am. And my husband quit his job to help me full time. My three daughters work for us. And, and here we are. And there you are. Well, that's awesome. That's awesome. Um, Norma, tell us a little bit about Fandango. What kind of um, techniques can people learn when they watch your class and sure. uh, the fabrics and all of that good stuff? Sure. Well, the biggie that I think is big is um, learning to paper piece. Um, it's going to be a beginner paper piecing class, so to speak. And so I'm kind of encouraging people that have never tried it before to jump in and, and try to do some paper piecing. And we're going to do Y seams. Um, but anyway, if you know about paper piecing, it'll be a review. So come on and join us. So I always tell people, don't sweat it. I'll show you everything about it. We use Tula Pink fabrics. And um, in the kit, we use a fairy dust lavender behind the background. So um, it has the pink background in the kit and it's just wonderful. So I would highly suggest jumping in class and learning those techniques. Yeah, why well, seems you're gonna tell me they're easy, right? I am, I am. <laughs> my, my big thing, my big sign is gonna say, don't sweat it. <laughs> and um, Nancy, tell me about, now you designed the quilting pattern, I right? Did. Yes, I actually had a, a different customer call me up and ask me to design patterns for this. And then they, they just turned out fun. And Norma, I don't know if I asked her if she just used them and put them in her Fandango quilt. Um, yeah, you called me up and you said, hey, I think, um, because she knows I teach a lot of online, she says, hey, I think you should teach that um, class and do a placement class because I long arm and, and place in it and I do videos all the time. So we kind of talked about doing that. And so, um, and Nancy does that to me. She gets me into things. So anyway, and I was like, once I saw the quilt and I made it and I did the video on the placement, I said, Hey, we need to make this a class because this would be a great, great, uh, beginner piecing class or not beginner piecing, but paper piecing. So yeah. I wanted to make sure that people always ask me, why don't we do a class with that? So I was like, Nancy, this is awesome. I'm going to make this a full class. So in the class, will they learn about the quilting? Well, Nancy, are you going to be on the class? Um, I don't know. You are. <laughs> what my part is going to be. <laughs> I know. <laughs> you are. You're coming. I'm dragging her along. She's coming. I, and I, I told her that we'll do a little section on, you know, once you make a quilt, you got to know how to quilt it, right? Right. Get ideas, you know, and what looks good. And so, yeah, I'm pushing her in to, to join in me. So we're going to see her on April 23rd, too. Oh, that's awesome. Nancy, you're going to be there. <laughs> <laughs> it is. I do get customers email me constantly. How would you, what would you put on this quilt? What would you put on that quilt? And that's what got me going and creating whole quilt sets for my club. Awesome. Well, right. you know, we've got a kit. We do. And we want to show you our version of this. Okay. We're just going to kind of, kind of pull it out here. Uh, uh, like, we, like quilters we are, our binding is not oh. finished. <laughs> so this is our version. That's beautiful. Isn't that beautiful? And the binding is going to be this purple. So that's what it's going to be. So that when you guys, um, you can, you can do your own fabrics if you'd like to for the class or if you're like me and you want to just have a box with the fabrics in it already ready selected ready to go you know you can order our quilt for the class and if you order our quilt this is the version you'll get with the this um what's it called norma the fairy dust fairy dust it is yeah. it is called fairy by tula pink yeah and it, actually i like it better yeah and so yeah, we remade our quilt using uh, True Colors, the collection, the basic collection from uh, Tula Pink called True Colors. And I really loved I love this. the way it turned yeah. out. Now, this is a good example. You can't really see this from where you guys are, unfortunately. This is a really good example of the quilt 
quilted edge to edge. So you don't have to quilt it this way. If you're more comfortable quilting it edge to edge, it really is, is nice edge to edge as well. So I was really pleased with the way this turns mm -hmm. out. So if you want to take the class and if you want to um, get a quilt kit already put together, we've got that link up with the class and you're, you're welcome to do that. I recommend you go ahead and order your, your fabrics as early as you can, mm -hmm. just because Norma, Norma has some homework for you before you get to class. I, I do. And speaking so. of that, Christy, um, we do a template as well. And um, the pattern is free. So you can make your own templates if you want, but it's very specific to the size of template that you need to make. So what I did to help you um, is I have it on my web store. And when you sign up for class, you'll get the link. And you can do uh, the template is very large. It's 18 by 24. And I've got them all made up and ready to go just for you. So you can order those if you want to. But okay. those are helpful things that will help you get the template, get the kit. Those are things that will make class just zoom and you have some pre-cutting to do. Sounds okay. like a fun class, yeah. doesn't it? It does. I think I'm going to do it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm excited yeah, about it. I know. Yay. I know. Christy's in. <laughs> All righty. Uh, well, you guys, thank you so much for joining us. Oh, thank you. And we're going to look forward to this class. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. April, April 23rd, you guys, sign up, sign up, sign up. So. <laughs> Join the party. <laughs> Join the party. That's right. We're going to have fun. <laughs> All right. Um, one of the things I wanted to just mention to you guys um, is we're about to leave uh, Sunday for our first Land Ahoy mm -hmm. event. Now this is something that we really, really been looking forward to. Uh, our first Land Ahoy event is going to be in Orlando and we literally leave Sunday, Sunday. Uh, Valentine's Day for this week of fun in Orlando. Now I want to tell you we've got a final push on our second Land Ahoy event is going to be in Nashville and you're going I'm going I'm super excited yeah uh, Christy's going on that one she is from Alabama so that's just like right in your Coming, backyard I'm going home. absolutely yeah and you've been to these places haven't have. you yeah. why don't you tell them a little about okay. it so um, it's kind of so Land Ahoy is like a cruise on land so we're going to have quilt and fun and quilt and teachers, but also excursions. So some of the excursions we're going to, we're going to some quilt shops um, local to Nashville, but we're also going to see some historic sites, which is fabulous. Yeah. So um, we'll be going to some, some uh, civil war places. So like um, the battlegrounds. Car battlegrounds, Carnton Plantation, um, Carter's House. There's several different places that we're going to just kind of see the history. Yeah. And I want to tell you, I went, um, Aaron and Amy and I vetted all the hotels before we chose the hotels for this event. And we went to Nashville. And honestly, when we were going across the country, Talk, going to all of these hotels, Nashville, this Sheridan Hotel in Nashville was the one, Sheridan Music City, I think is what it's called. Mm -hmm. uh, that was the one that we were a little unsure about because it's an older hotel and we really didn't know what to expect when we got there. But we got there and you guys, it had completely, the year before, completely been gutted inside and out and like a new hotel was put into that old building. And it's absolutely beautiful there. The, the facilities are very nice. The rooms are very nice. Mm -hmm. We've got a huge ballroom um, and we are gonna, uh, there's, there's only one restaurant in this particular hotel. It's really close to the airport. There's one restaurant, um, but we're gonna, they're gonna provide food trucks which I think That's will be, be so, so much fun. fun. I know. In addition to all the food we're going to have, um, uh, there's just tons and tons of food. Now, one of the, one of the concerns that we hear over and over, of course, is the safety measures that we are taking with Land Ahoy. <clears throat> and 
we are not requiring people to wear a mask in the classroom. You will have to wear a mask when you go out into the hotel. Um, some people are concerned about that. But what I explained to them is, is that our ballrooms are so big, there's mm -hmm. very, very easy for you to social distance. If you're concerned, just, you know, you're going to have a table by yourself. It's going to be more than six, huge. six yeah. feet away from anybody. Just keep your distance, you know. And so I think we can control it doing that. And I think that we still will have a really good time and we'll be really safe. I know, I don't know. Well, I'm sure all of you are like me. I am ready to cruise again. I am ready to do things again. I am ready to do events again. And so we're just having to work through this and figure out the best way to do it. And I think we are going to have a really good time and be very, very safe. So that's just what I want to say, say about that. We're really looking forward to it. And uh, let's see, Nashville dates. Do we know the Nashville dates? March the 14th. March the 14th. March the 14th. One that month, whole week. Yeah, one month after Orlando. Mm -hmm. Then we go to Texas the next month. We go to Vegas the month after that. And then we, our last one is going to be in San Diego. Diego. Yeah, so that's going to be great fun. Mm -hmm. So check on the website. All the information's on the website. You can get the details and sign up there. And But really sign up for Nashville. It's going to be loads of fun. So, um, okay. I think the okay. next thing we have, we are going to cut to Erica, who is in the store. And she Just has a got a Bernina update. Erica, how are you? She says, Erica, how are you? I'm good. How are you? <laughs> good, good, good. What do you got for us today? What do you got for us today? What have you got for us today? <laughs> what have I got for you today? I have all kinds of goodies. So as y'all know, we've been harping on our special edition package here. I still have a handful of these ready to go. Um, we're waiting on a couple more to come in, but they're still on sale. Buy a $7.90, get a $4.80 special edition for free. Um, you get the matching bag set with it. I'll pull this over. Oh, nice. So you get three bags there, one for each machine and one for your embroidery module. Those are beautiful. Those are gorgeous. And they have the Ann Louder design Ann on them. Peacock Flourish design, yes. And yeah, pretty. her bolts up here to show how it matches the machine. Rachel, can really you show a close up of the front of that machine? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I just want to make sure everybody realizes what this special is. This is the most incredible special that Bernina has had in a long time. The special is this if you buy a 790 mm -hmm. machine. You get a 480 absolutely free, mm -hmm. plus the luggage. And so somebody, you know, says, "Well, why would, why do I need two machines?" What? Well, yes, you need. Everybody two machines. needs two machines yeah. at least. Yeah. For one thing, that 790, you're going to want to do embroidery on, mm -hmm. and then you'll have the 480 to sew on while your embroidery is stitching out, mm -hmm. and of yes. course. The other thing is that the 480 is great to take for classes. It only weighs 21 pounds, so it is very mm -hmm. easy to transport. 21 pounds, that's perfect. Mm -hmm. Perfect to take to classes. Yes. We've only got a few of these left. So you guys, if you want one, contact Erica at the number on the screen and uh, let us give you the details. Um, do we have 60 easy payments on this, Erica? We do not right now. It's 48, 6, 12, 48, 48 easy payments. Yes, ma'am. Okay. So we can make, we can make it really affordable for you. We yes, really, really can. So, uh, anything else? Yes. So actually what Bernina is doing for February, it is National Embroidery Month. So if you purchase the Designer Plus version 8.2 software, you get a hoop of your choice for free. Wow. So, Miss Deb, I know you have that 880. So, the jumbo hoop typically runs between four and $500. That's really nice. It's my favorite hoop. 
<laughs> so you purchase that embroidery soccer, you get any hoop of your choice absolutely free. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, very, very cool. Um, also, the foot of the month, a lot of people ask what the foot of the month is. This month it is the number 39, so your couching foot. Oh, you, you can do a lot of great things with that couching foot. Lots yes. of fun things. And I'm actually going to feature that in the video when we get back from Orlando, so keep an eye out for that. A um, couple more things I wanted to touch on. Bernina has some awesome webinars and classes online. So while we're going through our construction and we can't fit huge classes, go online and take, take a look at those. So the version 8 software, they actually have a free webinar on February 18th. Check that out. See if it's something you're interested in. Or if you get on Bernina.com or the We Also blog, there are tons of projects you can do on there. We've been sharing a lot of Bernina's helpful tips and trick videos, all kinds of cool stuff. But We Also has patterns. They've got videos. There's tutorials. Tons of great info that people can do at home right now. Awesome. Well, so you're going to Orlando. Are you excited? I am, yes. And I'm so happy it's freezing here. We're going to be in Orlando. <laughs> I know, I know. I can hardly wait. It's so much fun. Oh, um, yeah. Cool thing we just set up. Uh huh. So we've been teasing Handy Quilter. We now have our Capri 18. <gasps> oh my gosh, I haven't seen that yet. Very so this cool. is the sit down version. We are going to have two other machines on frame set up on the floor. I believe those are going to be built tomorrow. So come in, look at the Berninas, look at the handy quilters. We'll have a ton of stuff out here for you to play with. Awesome, neat. All righty, you guys come in and check us out. Uh, give us a call. We'll be happy to talk to you about it over the phone. If you're, uh, if you have any questions, um, just give Erica a call and. She can answer all of your questions. All right, Erica, thank you very much. Bye-bye. <laughs> all righty. Well, lots going on at Stitch in Heaven. We, we have acquired a new handy quilter uh, contract dealership, mm -hmm. and we are getting those set up. We've got some really fun things coming up with handy quilter that you'll be hearing about in the near future. Uh, and by the way, if you haven't done it yet, be sure and register for our newsletter. Just go to our website and you can uh, sign up for our newsletter and you will be the first to get information on the special things that we have mm -hmm. going on and the events and especially with a lot of classes coming up. A lot of classes coming mm up, uh, some fun stuff, lots of free stuff. Um, you know, um, free patterns. Mm -hmm. We give things away. We just, we have a lot of fun around It here. is a lot it's, of it's fun. It's a fun job. Oh, it's such a fun place to be. It I'm is. so blessed. It is. Well, we're blessed to have you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> All right. The last thing I want to talk to you about today is our so special sewing space. Um, this is something that we're doing to, you know, I'm on a group, um, about sewing spaces. I can't remember the name of that group. You're on there. Mm -hmm. uh, anyway, there's a Facebook group and we just, there's so many people who post such beautiful ideas about their sewing space. And what we do is we contact a lot of them and ask them to submit a video mm -hmm. for us. I get and so just, many ideas from that too. Yes. It just makes my sewing space better when I see their innovative ideas. Yes, exactly. So we're, we're, uh, let, I think we've got a, t a little short video of one of our sewing spaces. We were going to show you to give you an idea of what it is. So let's, let's watch that. But let me just take you around and show you what I've got. I, I hang my, my tote bags here. Uh, like everybody else, I have a lot of unfinished projects, which I have here. This is one of my favorite things. This is a way for me to organize my rulers. And basically this is just a curtain rod and I use some hooks to hook the rulers in and hang them up. This way I don't buy rulers more than once. I don't know if any of you have ever done that, 
but before I had my rulers all stored in a drawer and I could never find what I needed and I would buy a ruler multiple times. Well, in order to prevent that, I can now see what rulers I have. So I really love this little um, display of rulers. Then I have my cutting board here, my cutting table. I had this built. I do use the Martelli uh, cutting mats. I love these, these um, cutting mats. They are self-healing and they are truly two-sided. On the other side, this one's yellow. So when I, I wear out this, this top, I can turn it over and use the other side. It's a little more expensive, but really you're getting two in one that way. That's why I love the Martelli. Okay. Well, that was me. <laughs> but anyway, um, that's the style we do for our videos. It's very easy. You just get someone to, 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 to hold a camera and you do it on your, on your iPhone, basically. So um, we want to invite you to submit um, your video your video so in space yeah. and we'll share it on the show. Yeah. yeah. And if we choose your video to be shared, we are going to give you a store credit uh, for submitting that. Not only will you be famous, but you will have money. <laughs> money to spend on products. <laughs> money to spend. Yes. So, all righty, you guys. Listen, we've had great fun here with you this afternoon. I uh, appreciate every single one of you. I hope I will see you in Nashville at Land Ahoy. Mm -hmm. And um, I just want you to stay warm and stay safe and keep on sewing. So this is Deb Luttrell. And Christy Smith. And we're Stitch in Heaven. We will talk to you next week, same time, same place. Talk to you later. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.